Mitch Wills, he's 18 but a kid still. Toys in the kids' mill still give him big thrills. He can't sit still, he's hyperactive. If he was my child, I would smack him. He's like a brat, he has conniving tactics to piss me off whenever I'm relaxing. When I'm doing homework, he's quite distracting. He's never satisfied unless I'm reacting. Well, I guess I'm a spastic, cause I knew that he'd push me up to the brink. And I knew that he would get under my skin, but I still took the time and took him under my wing. I thought he could just be my prodigy, my little brother, let the little guy follow me, show him my ways, let the little guy copy me, even took the time to teach him biology. But he was crazy selfish, he was using me just to play with Kelsey, he'd be in my room and he'd be taking selfies and he'd snapchat the pics to like 80 twelvies. He's done my head in a mental, so now I'm just blunt like he's lead in a pencil, I'm like, hey Mitch, your head is so dreadful, <laughs> do you get it, it's dreadful? And it smells like a flaming turd. Your hairstyle's gotta be Australia's worst. Only David Attenborough rates it first because it's the perfect place where we could raise some birds. And I don't mean to be nasty, but if you ask me, you look like a palm tree. And please, Mitch, try and don't laugh. But you should model for Hawaiian postcards. And your party was a large debacle. Everyone was just playing past the parcel. And you were in the corner. You wouldn't share your prizes. You would have sitting there with like half an armful. You're an absolute prick. And I saw you cheat on Pin the Tail on the Donkey. Hold on.